Hello, it's me. Me! Hey guys, it's Mitch Comer, and as you see, I'm in League 13 now. Uh, the guild YouTubers is actually doing pretty good. We got, uh, I think we got 13 people now. We just leveled up. Um, so we're going to talk about some more strategy here. Uh, my character is now 120 health, which is great. As you can see, his is 127. You're like, well, how does he get 127? Well, in the guild options, you can actually select um, increase health by 7. But the only problem with that is that it only increases by 7 for 7 days. So it's not a permanent bonus, and I don't really know that it's worth it right now, especially with Turf Wars. I think what people should do is they should wait until their guild's leveled up a little bit more before they start adding perks such as that um, to their newly made guild. Alright, so in this gameplay, as you can see, um, I almost always will put the Legendary Knight in a 3 tile spot to maximize the amount of uh, damage I can do. And um, I, ref I almost always will refuse to put that guitar person, the guitar hero, um, down until those three guys are up. Um, and I, I won't always do that. Like if I really don't have any option and this is my first move or whatever, then I will I'll definitely knock out whatever I can. But I like to try to let them take as much put. I like to let them put down as much as they can, um, and I like to put my guys a little bit out of the way so that I can, with this character, hit the spikes and they'll all basically kill themselves within two moves. I've actually decided that Adam on the right side here. Uh, isn't worth it here in, the, in these later levels because you can only do so much damage you can only do like five and with all these boosts that we can get um, with the leagues that we are in now 13 15 12 all these leagues over here there's so much boosting that Adam's five damage to all the troops really isn't doing much now uh, the sons of wood or whatever his name is the bear uh, his damage, 14 and 14, that's 28 damage total to each character. That's a really high output. However, you gotta time it to a point where um, you don't accidentally kill your bear because you waited a little too late. And doing so, I like to use that owl that's right behind my dragon, um, decrease their attack, and then I like to activate the spikes so that they can all attack all the fuck they want to, um, and I'm gonna take way less damage than I normally would. Um, this time you saw that I, I uh, put the troops right there. Um, one thing I like to do is if I see a couple of guys, um, such as the shields or whatever, I'll then, after these spikes, I'll activate this, the uh, mute. Uh, the mute, or the silencer, or whatever you want to call it, that's a really strong move. As I said, there's a lot of buffs in this. So when you can completely eliminate all their buffs every time they summon a monster, then you're really freaking, you're really hurting the other guy here. Um, now you kind of don't want to use it if there's only one person, that they, they've only summoned one person, unless it's like the end and you know you're gonna win. I mean, feel free then, but you really want to try to maximize your effort uh, to disable them, yet not leave you completely wrong. Oh, and the game crashed. You guys having this problem? I, I seem to be having this problem quite often. The game just crashes in the middle of trying to play um, so here's the intro I really feel like they could really do better on this intro right here um, they ain't really got much of a background there's not much to look at they took three pictures pasted it on slapped on a logo I mean that's kind of like freaking something I would do for my thumbnail or something you know just to slap a bunch of shit together <laughs> Level up heroes to upgrade to improve HP and attack. Yes. Yes, we know that. Thank you so much. Successfully use hero ability. Dude, have you guys seen when the two heroes, like when you first enter and they basically roasting each other? Dude, that's, the, that's the funniest thing. That's, that's like the best thing ever. They don't like, it takes forever to get it started, but I mean, it's funny. There's a lot, there's a lot of Russians also playing this game. It's kind of discouraging because you know how when Russians start playing, you know, they take over. Oh, yeah, you guys see that Divine Arena? 
A lot of you guys are like, hey, Divine Arena, there's bots and stuff. Actually, believe it or not, Divine Arena um, is not bots. It's other players who chose the opposing character, and they can load it really fast because, I mean, you only have two options. So you'll be fighting against people of all skill levels, and, like, yeah, that's why there's a high chance to die, because there's a lot of high-level people. So, um, and if you don't believe me, if you really do believe it's bots, if you fight them a couple of times, you'll realize that some of them don't speak, but some of them are going to spam like, wow, unbelievable, you know, things like that. Uh, I, was, I already talked about updating, um, so we're going we're gonna to go ahead and upgrade to level 2. So here we are, we're upgraded to level 2. Uh, they basically doubled our, our members, which is great. A lot of a lot of uh, games, actually, their clans will allow you like 50 people. Um, and it's it's a lot of people. So, I mean, I guess doubling it isn't really much, but when you have 10 people, doubling it is helps out a lot. And uh, so the first one was like, ah, shoot, what was it, like 2,000? Or 1,000? It was 1,000. So to upgrade it again, I'll, I'll have to get 5,000 of those the influence points, which is that red flag looking thing. And I can use the gold to uh, buy upgrades, which, as we discussed already, you know, seven days isn't really much to use. Um, so one thing, also, when you guys are attacking in turf war, uh, always be aware that when you are attacking, and or you're trying to decide whether to attack or defend, you gotta you gotta remember that. I mean, if you're using way more troops to attack and you should be using some troops to defend because it, there's less troops, there's less troop cost to defend, you should probably defend and not attack because then you can save your troops till the third round or whatever on that day and go ahead and use the last of your troops to either attack or defend. The objective is to have as many tiles as you possibly can and if the enemy is deleting your tiles, then you're not going to be able to expand, your clan's not going to be able to work together to expand. So you, so definitely make sure that it, it's efficient um, to attack before you decide to attack some other random ass tile. Uh, yeah, I know you all want the awards, you all want the castles, and we will get those castles. But we can't get to those castles if we're getting flanked by the enemy. And you know from any game ever, even Call of Duty, you don't want to get flanked, otherwise your whole fucking team is going to get wiped. Alright. Um... So I'm, I'm uh, actually trying to get sponsors uh, for my car, but I mean, I don't mind having sponsors for my videos or for anything really. So if you guys would do me a huge favor, um, follow me on Instagram, Mitch Comer, follow me. I don't really know if Facebook counts all the match. I got thousands of friends on Facebook. Uh, but if you could subscribe to me on YouTube, um, it would really help the views that you guys do is actually what helps the subscribers not so much it's the actual views and the time put in to watch each video that uh, helps us youtubers grow uh, so as you see there the thumbs up that is the uh, soulbind option you guys are constantly asking hey what is uh, the pal whatever the I forget what it's called pal points or something like that um, the power points do is they'll give you a permanent bonus to your your character that can do it uh, For him that particular I think it took 14 to power him up and I don't have 14 Well, what you can do is you can go to any of the arenas that you've done and use your points towards them And then they're pretty generous for as easy it is to get those points or coins or whatever it costs for each specific shop They're pretty generous and you can typically um, get about 15 in a day maybe i'm exaggerating I don't, I don't really know um but you should be able to see that silence that silence is really an op move for uh sons of woods trixie however I, I don't really like her yet she seems kind of underpowered um for the freeze the freeze is okay and then he summons the demon and i really feel like if the demon had a little bit more health he'd be OP as fuck, but since he doesn't, I mean, Adam can knock him out, uh, Trixie really isn't much use unless she summons her witches or something, um, but, and the bear, 
It's gonna take a lot of damage from absorbing that, but at least he'd be able to use his spikes. And I can't, I can't use this, I can't say this enough. Um, when you guys are attacking, make sure that you have, um, try to, try to limit when you use your specials, because you really want to try to use it towards the end, um, so you can just obliterate them. Um, so, guys, I know a lot of you guys are having trouble in the Dark Tower. I know for a fact I was having trouble in the Dark Tower. Um, uh, what it does is it's, it keeps giving you a random set from your deck, and that is the hardest fucking thing to, to counter is whatever you have in your deck. And really, the only trick is to upgrade your deck. I mean, you gotta get... I feel like it's really just luck when it comes to the deck. Because you can have all the skill, but if your cards don't match up to their cards, you're gonna get annihilated. Like, there's not much you can do. Alright, so... Usually, usually I can click members, or... Yeah, click members, and I can scroll down, and I could select a bunch of people to join. If you guys want to join the clan, go ahead and feel free. Um, and I really appreciate all of you guys. Oh, there's the invite. I really do appreciate all the guys that are from the from the guild and have subscribed to me on YouTube. Um, I think you guys really are the best. I would, this clan or this guild really wouldn't be what it is uh, without you guys contributing. Um, one thing I've learned, I've been I've been a guild leader, uh, clan leader since 2012. So one thing I've learned, oh that's, that's, that's the last video you guys, you guys really should see that video. But one thing actually I've learned as a guild leader um, is when you want to recruit people, and hear me out, I've been a number one guild in many, many, many games. I've played a lot of games and I don't have them all recorded because I didn't really start doing YouTube until recent. But uh, when you're... Recruiting people, you want to you want to max out your entire list of guilds, uh, my entire members list, and then you want to kind of delete either the worst player in the guild or kind of delete um, the most inactive person. And what I would suggest, based off uh, other game I played, like uh, I played a Digimon game, is I kept deleting the worst player instead of the most inactive player, and that actually kept my influence level higher. And that was actually more beneficial to the clan. Um, more people, people didn't really see who was an actor and who wasn't in my clan. They mostly just saw I was ranked number one and I had the most points. And they joined for that reason. And because people kept joining, I just eventually kept getting rid of the lowest person. And eventually the most inactive person ended up becoming the lowest person and I would get rid of them. It's a pretty vicious cycle, but it is a cycle that truly works when you want to grow as a clan. Thank you guys for watching. Uh, I really do hope you guys would subscribe and help me get those sponsors. Um, I do have car videos, and that's mainly what I would like to get sponsored because I would love, love to wrap my car something beautiful. And, uh, you know, wrapping is really expensive. I can do it myself. I've been doing it for a couple years. So, feel free to help me out, share my videos. You guys, you guys are the best. Thank you.